Hi friends, this is Nitish doing CSC at GRIET. We have done a project regarding data mining under the guidance of Mrs. Y.S. Lalitha. And the project is named as prediction of student result. The first thing is to say about Vika. Vika is a data mining software which was developed by Waikato University of New Zealand. Vika stands for Waikato Environment for Knowledge Analysis. Here, the environment provides a collection of data mining, machine learning algorithms, and pre-processing tools. It includes various algorithms of which we choose classification for the prediction of student result. Vika was written in Java and can run on any platform. It stores the data in flat files, that is, in ARFF format. Here, ARFF stands for Attribute Relation File Format. Now, have a look at the a sample ARFF format. Outlook, temperature, humidity, windy, play are the attributes of weather. Now let us enter our project. Yes, here is the user interface of Vika. It consists of three main graphical user interfaces, Explorer, Experimenter and Knowledge Flow out of which the easiest way to use Vika is through Explorer. The Explorer window consists of six panels, Preprocess, Classify, Cluster, Associate, Select Attributes and Visualize, each having its particular task of data mining. Now let us have a look at the input file. Our input file having around 1000 samples consists of 12 attributes register number, name, rank, date of birth, category, gender, inter, inter percentage, SSC, SSC percentage, branch and result. These are the results of students of their BTEC first year. Now go to open file tab. and select the input. Here it is clear that Vika accepts ARFF files on default. We also have some other alternatives of which .csv is the best choice. Here the save button saves the file in ARFF format though our input is a csv file. Out of the 12 attributes, register number, name, date of birth can be removed as they are unique and does not affect our classification. Now choose classify panel. Here are several classifiers with preloaded algorithms. We choose j48 tree for better classification. Select use training set and make sure that our focus is on result attribute only then start the classification. Here is our classifier output where we can see our accuracy of our rules. Around 80% is the accuracy obtained. We can now visualize the tree of rules obtained. Right click and visualize tree. Here are the rules we got. For example, based on the input, a student having more than 871 marks in inter has passed in first year of BTEC. So now, let us test these rules on a new file and predict the result. Select supply test set and set. Open file and we have to choose our test file. Now let us have a look at our test file. Here the attributes are same as that of our train set but the result column is left empty and that is what we need to find out. Open file. 
select the test set thus our test file has been inserted now close and start the classification now right click visualize classifier errors and save the model to see the predicted results here is our predicted file open it in wordpad now it is clear that a new attribute predicted result has been created and here are the predicted results fail pass and so on hence we are successful in predicting the student results through the explorer interface we can also run veka through java just go to command prompt enter the path containing veka install files see program files veka 3.6 this is the path containing veka install files in this path we have created a java file using classifiers like vika.classifiers.meta filtered classifier and using add tree j48 etc this java file is inserted with training and testing data here training data is 78all.csv which contains the result field whereas for the testing data 09all is the testing data which contains the result field an empty result field which is to be predicted now we have to run this java file to get the predicted results these are the predicted values obtained we can view these results clearly by redirecting to a new file s yes. now open this new file from the folder thus we are successful in obtaining the predicted results of the students present in the testing data thank you